Saturday night takeaway star Ant McPartland, 47, was holding up a clapperboard prop to the camera as Nicole Scherzinger, 44, tried to guess which American movies viewers were acting out at home. However, it all went horribly wrong when the board broke in half in his hands, leaving Nicole shocked. It fell apart in the heat. The open-mouthed star exclaimed, while collapsing into fits of giggles. Meanwhile, special guest Nicole, who showed up in a neon yellow dress for the show's finale in Orlando, Florida, tried her best to keep her composure and continue as if nothing had happened. Also on the show, which was broadcast live from the USA and included participation from viewers in Britain via video link, Wheatus performed a live rendition of their soft rock ballad Teenage Dirtbag. The murderer in Murder at Bigwig Manor was also unveiled, ending weeks of speculation over how Dermot O'Leary, Keith Lemon and Judy Love could have been killed off. Anton Deck had announced the Who Done It Challenge last month, declaring, two dead bodies in a remote manor house owned by a shadowy figure miles from anywhere with no mobile phone signal. You know what this means, don't you? The mystery was solved this evening, as the female killer revealed how Shed slipped a laxative into drinks and poisoned gravy in a meal while distracting a waiter, in a bid to kill the numbskulls. As the action unfolded, fans took to Twitter to lament they would no longer be entertained by Saturday Night Takeaway each week. Some admitted they were in tears, as they came to terms with the action ending, with one exclaiming, still can't believe it's the last episode. The problem with watching literally any TV show is the fact that it has to end and eventually the last episode comes around quicker than any other, another fan declared sorrowfully. Not ready for it to be the last one for another year hashtag Saturday Night Takeaway, cried a third. Meanwhile, another praised, do you know how impressive it is that they've taken a studio show, including the audience, and moved it seven hours across the world seamlessly? Fans can console themselves as the show ends with the news that the first nine contestants to appear on the All-Stars spin-off of Emma Celebrity. Get me out of here! Have now been announced. These include 64-year-old Paul Burrell, a former butler to the late Princess Diana, who has just finished grueling radiotherapy treatment for prostate cancer, and former Coronation Street star Helen Flanagan, 32, who will be leaving three kids behind to camp in South Africa. Others include former Countdown star Carol Vorderman, 62, former boxer Amir Khan, 36, ex-supermodel Janice Dickinson, 68, Diversity's Jordan Banjo, 30, and Happy Monday's star Sean Ryder, 60. Also confirmed are 62-year-old Fatima Whitbread, a retired javelin thrower, and 56-year-old Phil Tufnell, once an international cricketing legend, 